Alrighty, so today's agenda. Just woke up not too long ago, and let's see. We got the gym coming up in a few. We gotta go grocery shopping, and then I have a barbecue with some buddies coming in a little bit. That's not for tonight. Oh, and I'm pushing my fast to uh, 18 hour window period from 15, so I don't get to eat from 6 p.m. till 12. And yeah, so hopefully the weight loss continues, and hopefully I'll get to read some of this book, When Breath Becomes Air. It's a cool book. Uh, it's about a neurosurgeon who had a brain tumor that was inoperable, and while he was on his deathbed, he wrote that book, so it should be interesting. Yeah, okay, catch you guys later. All right, so we're here at the gym right now, and we're gonna be doing shoulders and traps. So we're gonna start off first with some shoulder press. Hey man, no rush. Do you no rush, dude. I don't know how it gets so tangled when you just leave it in your pockets, but yeah. So for this one, you want to put your hand under through the hole, grab around. This will be your top hand. Then you come to the other side. This will be your under grip. You do the same thing. You go through and you grab around. Come to center and then you're good to go. We'll make a path out of nothing. We'll make a path. Keith, say hi to the camera. Hi, Ashton. <laughs> Anything to say, Keith? This is my buddy from the gym. He works here. Hi. He makes steak drinks. Yeah. Oh, do hey, don't be camera shy, man. I'm not camera shy. You're just recording me for no reason. Hey. Hey. <laughs> I'm kidding, man. Hey, I'll catch you later, Keith. Bye. Are you going to work out right now? We just finished up. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, your hair looks different. What is why? Does it? You just style it today? There you go. Now let's just like normal. Looks better. Ah. Thank you. Bye, Ashton. Later, bro. All right. I just finished up with my workout. And I'm about to have my first meal of the day. A little Costco pre-made package. Uh, there we go. Some Caesar salad, a little bit of ranch. So yeah, all right, uh, the book that I'm reading is right here. Totally blanked out on it, it's um, When Breath Becomes Air. It's a pretty good book, I'm just like 20, 30 pages into it. It's about a neurosurgeon who was on a, he had an inoperable tumor and he wrote the book when he was on his deathbed. It was really cool. And his interactions with patients and whatnot. I'll see 
as I go through the book, I'll try and reflect upon things and topics in the book that I can talk about. But yeah, so I guess first and foremost, the news for today, I decided to go to UCLA for school. It was a little tie between a few of the schools and campuses, but I uh, went ahead and looked a little bit more into the campuses and the majors and whatnot, and I chose uh, anthropology, the scientific BS, a BS in anthropology over at uh, UCLA. And yeah, I'm excited to go learn some things over there and try and become the best version of myself. You know what I noticed about uh, self-control though, which was something that I brought up in the last video of things that I want to work on, is uh, I, I'm starting to do little things here and there that help boost my self-control, like whenever I'm doing something I shouldn't or when I see something that I want to eat and I make sure to tell myself no, even though I want to at the time. Uh, it's starting to add up and like the hardest thing for me was to wake up on time or at least wake up multiple times without actually getting out of bed. So now it's actually not even that hard for me to just wake up and hop out of bed. Like I don't even have to think about it. It's kind of cool having a good self-control and whatnot. But yeah, I wish I could be like a cool YouTuber who had a shit ton of stuff to talk about as I'm eating casually and talking, but I don't. Um, oh, I guess I could talk about where I'm at with, uh, this is ranch, I think, yeah, super good, uh, where I'm at with my fitness. So I bumped up my intermittent fasting, which is the period I don't eat. For, or from 15 hours to 18, so I basically don't eat from 6 p.m. to around 12.31, depending on the day, and yeah, it sucks, but the way to get through it is uh, some coffee and some chewing gum does the trick usually, and lots of water. That helps fill out the belly. I guess when you uh, don't eat for long periods of time, your body releases a chemical that tells your brain to uh, be hungry. And it doesn't matter what you put in your stomach, as long as it makes your stomach feel stretched out. If you do that, you're gonna feel full and your hunger is gonna decrease. But that's kind of just like common knowledge. But yeah, so I just, uh, I started off my cut at about like 188, about three weeks ago, four weeks ago. Now I'm down to about like 178, and I'm probably about like 11% body fat, somewhere around there. My goal is to get down to about like 8. And try and manage to hold that for a little couple of months. It's not easy to stay lean. It sucks. Bulking so much funner. You get to eat more. Yeah. I'm learning more and more every time I cut. Back when I was younger, and I'd get into my cuts, I'd literally lose, I'd lose weight but I'd be in ketosis and which is just fancy term for burning fat and I would just not be able to sleep I'd be like a insomniac that sucked I'd be so hungry that I just can't sleep no matter how hard I try so yeah you just learn how to ease your way into a diet my buddies sometimes uh, we call it the crash diet where you just go into a diet so hard so fast because you want results but then you just as easy as you get in the diet, you're gonna get right back out because it's not sustainable. But yeah, I'm trying to do it where it's like a lifestyle. It's not just like a diet because diets are temporary, lifestyles are forever. But you know, try to gotta do what, or gotta do what you gotta do. So yeah. So how are you? How are you doing today? Oh, you're you're good. Cool. To all my five viewers out there, it's good to see you again. My seven su subscribers. Um, yeah, I love our nice little talks and shit chats. It's so great getting to know you, you know.
But yeah, so in a couple hours, uh, my buddies are going to come over. We're going to cook some chicken and some cool things. Try and be healthy. And tomorrow's Game of Thrones. I'm stoked for that. But yeah, so I got probably like a little bit of setting to do. Genetics. Which isn't that bad, actually. I thought that class was going to be harder. And then... Do a little reading. This book. Um, I, you know what I should do? I should review some uh, some of the good books that I've read. I, I'm more of a fan of self-help books. That's that book I'm reading right now on uh, When Breath Becomes Air. is like one of the more story-like books, but it's still kind of self-help that I'm reading. I tend to gravitate towards like things that are applicable to me. And sometimes I don't draw that connection with like fantasy books or stories and so yeah i like uh like the power becomes or the power of habit by charles duhigg that's my favorite book yeah that's all so enough chit chat i will uh probably videotape the barbecue for you guys in a little bit but until then i will see you guys later just kidding First female on the blog. Oh my god. Ben, gosh. say hi. It's a vlog actually. It's a vlog. Anyways, we're doing a barbecue, so right now we're trying to find some good fashion meat. Chicken? Breast? Yeah. yeah. We're trying to find some chicken and then we're gonna get some uh, steak to cook for later. And yeah. We're we'll gonna find it up. Yeah. yeah. Cool. Quit. What's up, people? So, we just got back from the grocery store right now, and we got a crap ton of groceries, so check it out. First off, we got some corn, then we got some avocado, turkey burgers, skirt steak, turkey bacon, strawberries, angel cake, don't know what this is. Got some protein powder, and then we got a shit ton of beef. So, once we cook this up, we'll show you what it looks like. Yeah, man. All right, so this is the shake right here. We started off with milk, cookies and cream protein. Almond milk. Almond milk. And then we got bananas, right. spinach, Zoom up. a teaspoon of peanut butter, some fat, Ew. And, then, <laughs> and then ice. And then we have some cauliflower Wait, with taco say? powder. It's all diced and what whatnot. Say? And we have That's our what did you say? turkey it's bacon it? with some Fuck eggs you. and a little bit of cheese. That's offensive to me. And then out here, Get over it. How would you feel if I said to you when? We got the chef cooking out here. All right, Jad, how's the meat cooking going along? That's well. Well done. How's it going, Jad? There we go. Hello. So, the last people just uh, left right now, and it's like 1.30 a.m., and I'm exhausted, and I can't wait to sleep, so... Today was a uh, success. It was a long day. But uh, I need my sleep. So I will catch you later.